Oh my goodness, when did he come up? Okay, well, I got a little hard out for the night. Oh, I suggest that now we try to find ourselves a Hebeus camp. Or a cooking pot. Or both. Alright, let's see what these terror bosses have. We need to get ourselves some explosives. Even if we can't make arrows, we definitely can start uh, throwing them as projectile types. Almost like rocks. And if we manage to get ourselves a slingshot, even better. You, we'll go for the tiny one. It might turn a lot darker than I thought. Ow. No. Bad. You might have fists, but I have pierces. Yes! Oh, knocked down again, eh? Hey! Look at that. I have space, right? Yeah, I do. Cool. Oh! To find the big mate. Oh! <laughs> I never thought. Come on. Ah! Something tells me your hits are going to be very painful. I didn't want to start that. We didn't start the fire, I swear. Oh jeez. Thankfully, day three is coming close to an end. I'll be sure that we're careful. Come on, Terrible. I know you want to fight. You look like you do. Ah, oh, thank goodness. Come on. Oh. Okay, we're healing up. already. Not me, but you know what I mean. No, 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 no. Do it heal. Come on. I'm going to cut you down the size. Okay, you're coming close to, to death. I know it. God, this grass is so annoying. Grass. There's so much tall grass everywhere. Come on! Nice! Oh, there it is. Hey, look at that, more potatoes. I don't think I have the space for it there. Oh god, it's stuck in the thing. Can I look? a sword. I could use this. That's pretty handy though. I'm glad that we found one. You know what? I can actually cut the uh, meat pieces now, right? Yay, it does. I'm thankful for that. I've been waiting for that. That's also something we can make, I noticed. I forgot that if I I can use the bone shards to make arrow tips. Should I keep them? No, we gotta keep them here. Cause you never know. I know that we still need to try to get some heart flowers as soon as possible. Yeah, we are gonna survive out here. Ah! Ultra attack! <laughs> um... Nope. Nothing yet. Oh, sorry, I think I should flip these. For some reason, having this in hand. And the... 
fire my other one would be better. Something about it is. I believe these are damaging. Probably don't want to run into it. Ah! Aerial attack. They never saw it coming. Ah! Okay, maybe that, that, that they saw coming. Two v one situation. Oh god. Ah, this grass is so bad for this combat too. That's kind of a main problem as well. Oh, fire of combat! Come on, I need eyes. I need your eyes. Give them to me. Oh, okay. We'll live up on that. Let's see. Get terror eyes. Sorry, terror butter eyes. Something crack. I think it did. Oh. Nick. Oh. Yes. I am very, very thankful for that. Okay. Let's go and get meat in here. So now we have an open space for something else if we need it. Personally, I think I sh we should leave the sword on reserve for now. Just so that we have our main axes at hand. Oh, Alright, let's follow this river. Okay, we found where it ends. <laughs> this is really where it ends. Yeah, I think it just starts from the middle of the novel. Oh, jeez. You scared me. Ow. Oh, okay. This is definitely good territory. Good territory. <laughs> Ah, it's nice being up for the whole... camp! Okay. Um, well, we've got to be very, very, very careful here. We're going to be camping out in this little spot. Absolutely. I'm most careful. Especially if I'm the mates made of walnut. We can neglect any of this. Let's get through. Volatile. Okay, as long as one of them sees, sees me, I think it'll be okay. But... If they all see me, I think we're doomed. Oh god, I forgot about that. Oh god, that's right, I forgot about the spores. I forgot they're the ones who do that. I know how to get in. Haha. Sporadic behavior. <laughs> Wait, I see white light. Is that a glowing mushroom? Oh, that would be so nice. Oh god. Okay, we've got good hits in there. Oh. Wow, we are deep in go terror territory. We're deep in go territory right now. That's not great. It's already hard enough fighting the mates back here. Thank God. Ah, oh, yes. I like that. Oh, look at that. We are doing so good right now. Oh god. Pickaxe broke. Retreat. Where and why? Did you follow me? He followed me. I'm glad that I have fans who are following me. What? This might... Oh my gosh. Yes! You didn't see me yet. Oh! Yes! Come on! Oh! This greatness. Come on. 
My other pick just broke. Why won't you get the bow hits in? <laughs> Come on, one more shot. Come on! Oh, yes! Victory! The EBU's camp is ours. Alright, let's take a look. Might as well set up a fire with all the stuff that's here. Yeah. Don't even need oh, I guess I'll leave it on accident. <laughs> okay, I think we're good. Still no cauldrons. But um, maybe I should have checked the chest for that first. We don't have climbing, so I hope we can get up there. Oh, there we go. Oh, you want the one? Why did all the chests spawn frantically in the walls? That's what I'm confused about. Here's another sword. Can I stack these? No. Hey, day five is happening. You know, that's fine. You can't have it. It's my knife and you can't have it. Oh, well, it's definitely a different chest that's doing that. <gasps> yes, mate. I was waiting for one of those. I think we can start by heading back down, collect some coal. And we should be clear to go. Uh, let's go ahead and eat some of these though. <laughs> Might as well eat the resources that are here so we don't have to go through our batch. Yeah. I feel like we should just avoid a phantom at all times. This would stun him, but I don't know if it would keep, keep it away from me. I guess if I just hear it run away. And maybe if we find the CBS camp again, we get some new stuff out of it. Unfortunately, no real new weapons. Uh, maybe that finicking chest down there will provide us with something. No, I'm gonna throw the arrows. I feel like I already mentioned this already. I, I probably did. <laughs> I think we said that we were gonna wait on arrows until we actually found ourselves a bell. So, keeping swords and everything like that is what we need. That first little camp section that we had, uh, had a lot of it. So I'm thankful for that. And it actually might prove more useful than uh, wood having coal. Ouch. So now we know we can fight walnuts and oak tree, Goterras. So we know where our skill level is currently. Still not that high. Oh yeah, I wanted to check that out. There's a little wall there. There might be something interesting. The only issue is we're going to have to cut through... ...good territory. And I know the red wards are there. There he is. So what? Yeah, this whole boundary from like up the hill and beyond this is all good territory. These mates didn't come back, did they? I hope he didn't. I kind of want to get the clothes room in there, but I know we can't reach it. Uh, we're going to have to keep running. We're going to have to keep running through this, this place if we're going to go anywhere. It's surrounded so heavily by Gotera. Oh god, oh god. I'm. Oh, I know that. Another base. Ow. That was rude. I think we're gonna have to just jump in there. Hopefully, we could get into a spot that's not. You know, volatile. So many of you, you see me. I know, I know. Abu, this is a whole area I haven't seen yet. It looks like we're at the edge of the forest. So we've got a pretty good layout of what this place looks like. I hate the, I hate the shotgun shots that they got going on. That is a problem. What does that sign say? Who knows? Can't read it. Is it the end of night 5 or is the start of night 5? Not the end. I was on the other side of this little pasture before. There's an area over here that I haven't been to. 
Right, no, this is where I came from, obviously. So we got to see the end of the forest off that way. There is the same camp that we saw before. There is that one little stand, but I don't think it does anything. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we have our thing now. Guess we should get it lit up. <coughs> there we go. Yeah, look at that. Super great. Okay, so we're going to have light the entire night this time. <coughs> I wonder how much it's actually going to help there. That's the bigger question. I'm going to have to... Oh my god, did you just spawn on top of us? <coughs> These mates are so busy with them down there. That's good. They won't be rubbing around for too long. Oof. That is night time. Makes sense I'd be yawning this much. Is there a tree and a rock? That actually looks pretty neat. I'm running in. Is the Ashwood one there? There he is. Should I be wary? I should. Every time this place is just loaded. There's never a mate who's like by himself. Except you, apparently. But it doesn't matter, you're not even really close. Really need to get ourselves a shield. Somewhere. A mushroom shield, maybe. Alright, so we made it to the forest wall. What are you? Are you a Luma Shruma or are you just a Shruma? You're just a Shruma. Which I'm very happy about. Thank you. Probably replace my lantern so we're not consuming coal. Right, so we just leave you somewhere. Maybe a little milestone placement right there. Oh god, you scared me. Oh, is this where you made sleep? <laughs> it's a nice spot, isn't it? So I'm wondering if, if there's one of these around and that means I mean one of the one of the big guys is out here. Okay, this area looks new. This must yep, it's a birch forest. Yeah, this is really the way out, isn't it? Can't imagine how you would get here from the start though. Yeah, look at that. This birch. This is the most dangerous and beneficial time of day in the forest to do this. I like the birch forest at night. Just the white blue mix of the night sky makes it look so fanciful. Oh Jesus God. Okay, you can't do that. That's not okay. I don't know why it didn't really occur to me that that place was, you know, pretty bleak. There wasn't a lot of creatures. Really? Are you the only one? And you spawned right in front of me. Is the birch forest haunted? Because it certainly feels like it. Oh, there's a well. Shoot, they're gonna be shooting at me. Man, stuff just really did not want to load in. Maybe I missed a heart flower and didn't know it. Oh, there's another well. Man, they have these things really close in proximity. Don't these usually signify some sort of worm spawn? I feel like they do. So we've conquered a Hebeo's camp so far. I really want to get that last one. Okay, one more. Ooh. I was very worried about you. I'm not running into that, no thank you. I'm out. <laughs> oh, that could have been so bad. So we've encountered... We've encountered a phantom, finally. What is this, like, episode two? That was quick. Yet again, I expect if you're in the forest for a very long time, you're bound to see one. No way. Oh, I was going to say, no way, I'm letting you mates hit me, and then I got hit. Oh. Wow. Wait, seems. 
That's a pretty cool bridge. If the map weren't so weirdly laid out. Get across and look at this little waterfall here. That's so cool. But this is still weird. Okay, we really gotta storm this thing. Okay, okay, okay. I'm running in, I'm running in. Oh, come on. <sighs> nope, nope, nothing. Nothing of use there. Shoot. Oh, it's about to be day six. Okay, it looks like most of them are walking the opposite direction. So I'm gonna go this way. I'm going to quickly teleport up. Nope, nothing. Get down. Okay. Well, we conquer another location. No, we haven't even cracked these open yet. Oh god. <laughs> oh, these mates can crack them open for me. So we find any blade pieces in there. Ouch. Where they come back. Once they've calmed down a bit. Alright, I gotta just go for it. Anything? Nope, not from the looks of it. Oh god. Okay. That Hibio's camp is empty. Well, not empty, but practically useless. <laughs> 